Hey again, everyone. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm Chrissy. I just wanted to share with you something that I just did yesterday. It was so good. So I've shown you guys before how to make a cold brew coffee in our cold brew pitcher. I love this pitcher. It's so easy. The um, strainer and um, cup that goes down in here is in my dishwasher right now, but you fill it up just to the top of the filter with coarse coffee grounds. And then you use about five cups of water. I like to brew mine on the countertop for 24 hours. Then I take that strainer out and you can feed that coffee grounds to your garden. Um, and then I put this into the fridge. So I'm not gonna go into great deal detail with that because I wanna show you what I made. So a few years ago, Starbucks had a s'mores frappuccino and it was really good in the summertime and then they never brought it back. So I'm making my own version, but cold brew instead. So I've got a glass with some ice and then, oh, I know what I forgot. Hold on, I need the chocolate sauce. How could I forget that? Okay, so I'm gonna put a little bit of chocolate sauce into the bottom of this. It'll come out, there we go. Okay, you can use whatever kind of chocolate sauce you like. This is just what I had on hand. I'm gonna pour the coffee in. If you like, you can um, cut this a little bit with water, but I don't find that I need to. And then in the cup that comes with the Flex Plus for the immersion blender attachment, I have about three tablespoons of marshmallow cream. So this is a little bit by feel and you can adjust for your taste. And then I like this to be more of a latte than, or a foam than an all out um, whipped cream. So I've got, let's see, I have about four ounces of milk in there. And then I'm gonna dash a little bit of heavy whipping cream in. So this won't whip like a traditional whipped cream, um, but it's gonna be so good. Okay, so this is the stick that comes with the Flex Plus. You use it for everything. The food processor attachment, the immersion blender attachment, and the hand mixer. So you're gonna take the stick, you're gonna attach your immersion blender to it. Last of the party is the battery pack and you get two batteries along with the charging for it, okay? So you're gonna take this down inside. You have a safety right here, so I'm gonna push the safety and then I'm gonna bump the speed up. And I'm just gonna do this until it's nice and frothy. that's how you're going to get more air mixed in and you of course want to mix in that marshmallow cream. You know you've got it right when you lift the cup up. All right. So, just going to give this, I'd say, I don't know, 30 seconds to a minute. I like it really frothy. Okay, it makes it look prettier, right? And then I've just got like a tiny amount, like quarter of a teaspoon of graham cracker crumbs. Okay, so that is your cold brew s'mores latte. And oh my gosh, it is so good. I can't wait to enjoy this. So let me know if you have any questions. 
And if you'd like to try this, I'd love for you to shop with me. I have a sale going on right now. You can look below in the comments to find or below this post to find the link. Talk to you soon.